run, so it's about six o'clock in the morning at the moment. And today's plans is we're gonna actually be going out on the boat for the first time. Never taken it out before, so it should be pretty cool. We're gonna try catch some lunch. As you can see down here, I caught some bait in the cast net. We got some nice little potty mullet as bait, so we're not only gonna be shark fishing, but hopefully getting something big like a jack. We've also got these silver biddies, and these should be really good bait as well. I'm keen to catch anything today, anything that we can eat, that is. So I say we get in the boat, find a spot, and hopefully catch some big fish. pretty good the sun's just starting to come up at the moment and this is a really deep channel here leading into the middle of five different canals coming all into one so I reckon there'll be a heap of fish in here apparently there's an artificial reef in the middle of it as well so I say we get the baits out in the water and start fishing yeah 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 I got you yeah there we go <laughs> oh hooked up to a fish already literally had the rod out were you filming that whole time yeah Probably 10 seconds. Oh, oh, he got off. Look at the bait. It's been out there about 10 seconds and that's already happened. Nice little putty mullet. Perfect bait for jacks, trevally and everything like that. So I'm just getting a run at the moment. Yeah, there we go. Yes. Finally onto a fish. Took all morning, but it feels like not a bad fish. I reckon it could be a brim or maybe even a GT. Or an eel. Hopefully not an eel. <laughs> Anything that's no catfish. <laughs> this one's looking pretty good. I reckon it's a GT. We've been seeing these GT busting up all morning and it's good to actually finally get one. I was thinking about chucking a surface lure on earlier. But it looks like a live bait works just as good. That in there is a legal GT. I reckon we're gonna cook them up later. Haven't cooked up a GT in a while, actually. That's pretty cool. It's really good to finally get a fish this morning because we've been getting runs all morning and losing them. But that right there is a little giant trevally or GT. They're really common up these canals, especially in the Gold Coast. We saw them busting up all morning. I knew it was only a matter of time before we actually got one. They're a really good sports fish. Often you'll get them early morning and late afternoon on surface lures. But yeah, nice little GT right there. We'll get them in the esky. We were just about to fly the drone you can see it just down there then we got a big run oh yeah Ooh. there we go sorry about the noise folks good fish could be a three meter flatty yeah maybe look at that i think it came off that wasn't a stingray has been cut off when it was younger. As you can see, it's really healed up. This stingray doesn't need its tail to survive. But yeah, beautiful sized stingray. I'm gonna get it back in the water and keep on fishing. All right, so we're packing up at the moment. We've caught that trevally. We lost a couple of big fish there, but that's all right. We'll have to come out sometime this week and hopefully get some more. We're gonna start heading back home, get back to the jetty, fill it up that GT and cook it up. So we just filleted up the GT, we got one fillet, we're going to be cooking this one up right now. We made a batter, we put some eggs, flour, milk and cream all together, mixed them all up and that's what we've got here. We'll just put some olive oil, 
in the pan. Cooking it up in the boat at the moment, I thought it'd be pretty cool to not only catch my own breakfast in the boat, but to also cook up the food that I caught in the boat. I'm gonna have to catch some bigger fish, that's the next step up. We got a boat, I just need to find where the big fish are. At least it wasn't a Neil Tell catfish. We'll just drop the fillet into the batter. We'll just lay the fillet down in there, flip it over. There we go, I think that's about done. We'll just take it off. Put it just down there, that looks really good. The GT pancake. It's pretty good for a giant trevally. And I've got big plans for this boat right here. It was really cool going out on it for the first time this morning. Gonna put some 33s, a two inch lift on it and should be good. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Go follow me on Instagram if you want. Got plenty more videos coming soon every Friday. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you again next time.